So we got a ladder that rests uh, against a vertical wall. Um, and let theta be the angle between the top of the ladder and the wall. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw this diagram here. So here's the wall, here's theta, here's x, and then here's the ladder. And theta is equal to pi over three. So actually, actually, if this is pi over three, that's a pretty, that, uh, that ladder is at a pretty steep angle, even steeper than this. But anyway, um, this is about 45 degrees. So what we want to do is we want to find if the bottom of the ladder slides away from the wall, how fast does x change with respect to theta um, when theta is equal to pi over three. So uh, the equation for this is x changes at 10 times the sine of theta. So the ladder's 10 feet long there. So sine of, it was originally, okay, so it was originally sine of theta is equal to x over 10, and then we multiplied times 10, we got 10 sine theta is equal to x. Okay, so we wanna find the derivative because that's how we find the exact change with where, where, wherever it is because it's always changing. So dx d theta is gonna be equal to 10 cosine theta. And we plug, so this is our derivative. So you plug in dx d theta for pi over three, and we get 10 times the cosine of pi over three. So pi over three is um, one, two, root three. So we get one half. So one half times 10 is equal to five feet per radian change, roughly. And that's it.